Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. It's Brianna and in today's video, it is a study vlog and a week of online classes. I essentially just tried to be super productive and keep myself accountable by filming. So I hope this gives you motivation to get through your own online classes and to attend your 8 a.m.s. So without further ado, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel and let's get on with the video. Hey guys, welcome to voiceover Brianna. You probably noticed that I woke up around 7.30 and to tell you the truth, I've actually become a morning person now. I don't know how or why, but I've been naturally getting tired around midnight and waking up around 6 to 8 in the morning just automatically, which is so crazy because I literally used to sleep at 5 a.m. and wake up at noon. So I guess it is possible to change, but we'll see how long it lasts. I expect that you at least like tried the questions before coming to the tutorial, so you know which questions are the most difficult. So I previously told you guys that I am taking genetics this semester, that is my biology course, and I told you that I was actually really excited for it, and I was right about that, I guess. I think the lecturer for this unit is really good. It's really easy to stay engaged with the way that she speaks and the slides are actually helpful. So I'm just taking notes on those now. A lot of it is just review, but obviously that's just the first unit. And I actually did the unit test already before this video is going up, but I thought it was pretty fair and I'm excited for what the rest of the course is going to be like. So you guys probably could have guessed that all of my courses are asynchronous again. I always complain about it, but you know, I actually really do like it because I can do whatever I want at whatever time and I just have to meet a bunch of deadlines that they have set. So I can really make my own schedule. And I've lately been using Notion. You guys probably have heard of it. It's just like an online diary, planner, calendar, life organizer app all in one i just used one from Revisign. she's a youtuber you probably know her she's super sweet and her template's great i just modified it a bunch to fit my liking and i've been liking it a lot Hey guys, so I'm super conflicted about how I should be editing these videos. I don't know if you guys want them to be talkative study vlogs or if you want them to be aesthetic and silent study vlogs. Personally, I love the silent lo-fi music playing in the background kind of videos for study vlogs, but I don't know what you guys prefer, so please, 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 please comment what you would prefer and what you want to see from me because I obviously just want to make content that you guys would enjoy. Also, 4K on YouTube, I've literally had such a great time making videos. My channel definitely took off in 2020, even though it was such an awful year for so many people and for obvious reasons, but I would say for my channel, it was great. So just thank you, thank you, thank you for continuing to subscribe to me and like my videos and comment things. I love reading comments. I try to respond to every single one. I cherish all of them, I promise.
who would I literally be without my late night study snack instant ramen? I have an identity crisis if that snack didn't exist. Anyways, going back to my sleeping schedule from before, I've been sleeping early and waking up early for the past two weeks, and I think it was just... I, I honestly can't even pinpoint it. I think this one time I just worked out too hard and then I just fell asleep really early and then I was forced to wake up early because I got my eight hours and I've just been doing it every single day. So it's been really weird to have so much time during the day, but it's nice and I am beginning to appreciate it. So guys, that is the end of the study vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. It was essentially just a study with me that you could play while you guys are working just to give guys some motivation or to feel like there's someone there because most of us are learning remotely. It can be kind of lonely. So I hope this was helpful. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.